Hey everyone, welcome back to Boyka Gaming. Today we're talking about a problem that's driving me and probably a lot of you crazy. FPS drops. Before we jump in, let me know in the comments, how's the game running on your device? Is it smooth or are you stuck in a slideshow like I am sometimes? Alright, so today's topic is what's really behind those annoying FPS drops. And trust me, it's not just your imagination, this stuff happens even on devices you'd expect to handle anything you throw at them. First off, let's talk about the gyroscope. Now I thought turning it off would do nothing, but guess what, it actually made a huge difference. When I turned it off, the game was smooth, like butter, no issues at all. But the moment I turned the gyroscope back on, my FPS just plummeted. I'm talking all the way down to 20 to 30 FPS. It was like, oh, you thought you were about to have a smooth game. Think again, and here's the kicker. Even on my fancy iPhone 15 Pro, it sucked. So yeah, if you're out there thinking, oh, I've got a high-end device, I should be fine. Nope. Gyroscope doesn't care what you're rocking. Everything matters. Now let's get into texture streaming. This is where things get even spicier. On mid and low end devices, the processor is working over time trying to handle both gaming and streaming high quality textures. The result? The processor's like, dude, I can't do it. And boom, FPS drops. So if you're wondering why your game feels like it's being powered by a potato, there's a good chance texture streaming is the culprit. And of course, we can't forget about the servers. We've got limited servers, and with all that data having to travel halfway across the globe and back, your device is getting hot enough to fry an egg. And what do we get in return? FPS drops. Oh, and shout out to the Black Cell skins and operators for adding even more stress to the situation. Like, hey, want some extra cool skins? Sure, but how about we throw in a few FPS drops for free? It's like they're trolling us at this point. Look. These are just a few reasons why FPS drops are happening, and honestly, there's so much more going on behind the scenes. And just to be clear, it's not only happening on mid- or low-end devices. Even high-end devices are suffering. Nobody is safe. So if you've been in the same boat or you've got some hot takes on this, drop a comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. We're on the road to 2K subscribers, and trust me, we've got a lot more coming your way. Thanks for watching.